Right. Look at the size of this furnace. This thing's got to be 80 years old. Geez, these old places have got to be held to heat, huh? Well, this house isn't that big. What the hell does he need a furnace like this for? You know, I think there's been some modifications on this because this conduit is brand new. Look, it runs all the way back over there and up through a hole in the ceiling. I saw some of that in their living room. And a thermostat on a, on a home furnace, is that supposed to go to 5,000 degrees, you think? Must be what all the noise was. Look at all the stuff they put together down here. They, they got this whole place wired with batteries. There's got to be 40 of them. Look, we got, we got power here. <laughs> then buried his bones right here. What do we do now? I'll call in and tell them that they built a crematorium down no, here. No, don't tell them that. I'll just want to come down. Just wait till we find something. Wait, that could take all night. <laughs> Mr. Rumsfield, you guys managed to knock out the power in the entire block. Probably the whole south end of town. Ricky, shut up! Listen, now we're, we're gonna make a run to McDee's. You want a quarter pounder or something? Oh, no way! Hey, wait, you guys can't go now. It's the best part. I called the pizza dude. All right. Look! Dig down, I mean, besides us, we dig this deep into this kind of sludge. Oh. That was metal. Hey! That was metal. You hit it. You hit a crypt. They buried him in a crypt. Maybe I'll, I'll go get my blowtorch. I'll get the blowtorch. I'll, I'll call it in. I'll call it in. Hello! Where are you at? Uh, uh, Eagle Eye, this is Fox Force One. We have found Walter. We found Walter. I'll be out in just a minute. Stay there. Stay there. Oh, yes! We found him! We caught you, Rube. You've been playing us for saps, but you were wrong. Mister, we got a real problem. Hey, Ray, guess who's not in the basement? Walter! He's back! He's 
You found it. You, you found it, right? Before everything went off, you had to have found it. You got a lawsuit on your hands, mister. <laughs> 